Hello, welcome to another Dying Light 2 walkthrough. I am in game plus mode, means that my character has already gotten to the end game. I have then reset everything at a higher, harder level with less rewards, and I carried through all of my existing skill levels. My intent in this is to get through it and to figure out how to actually not bomb the city at the very end. I've managed to not take that option yet. Anyway, so today's video we're going to talk about a couple of things, so let's bring up our map. One, I am going to talk about two ways to get out of the downtown court metro station that become very useful for you. And then ultimately we are going to head down here to the bird watching side quest, which also puts us right next to the historical communications tower. So part one of this video is going to be to get take care of bird watching and part two is going to be to take care of the communications tower. We can have the community Cations tower open to us because we have finished the storyline through to the point of resolving the VNC tower. So what we're going to do is head in this direction, take care of these two things, and continue on with our story quest as we choose. So first of all, let's talk about getting out of the metro station the most efficient way possible as far as getting other ways. So you come up out of here. If you look over here to the left corner as you come out or up the stairs, you'll see two doors innocuously sitting there, but they open. In here are two elevator shafts. The elevator shaft on the right has a ladder up here and this actually leads you to the Couriers Guild, the most easy way without having to worry about any of the infected. On the other side is a lift that will take us all the way to the top of the building which allows us to then use our paraglider to get to a lot of other locations that we need to do. In this case, we are going to be heading off in that direction. This is ultimately where we want to get to. The easiest way to get to this is to first land on the military drop THB M30, which we've already acquired, and then paraglide across. So let's head there first. It's always a good idea to mark your landing spots. There we go. There's much air. Now it is probably quite easy or possible to get directly to the top of this tower, but I found it's easier to make a stop over here first. Also, if you're in game plus mode, a follow-up video will take us from this landing spot over this way to get to a game plus only inhibitor. But as you can see, we are here and we need to get there. A couple things over there. We've already been here because there is a Nightrunner's hideout that I've already turned on or activated but if you notice all that dust floating around that shows that we have a continual updraft so all we want to do is climb up here and then we will get into that updraft and that will carry us on to that building pretty neat eh much easier making a two-stop run so what we need to do for the first part of this, or the first step of this, is get up here in order to find the bird's nest. What? There is an inhibitor in here. Did not realize that there is an inhibitor in here. There's another one over that way. Well, 
extra bonus, there is an inhibitor here. So let's pick up that inhibitor. So this is the first event of trying to figure out how to navigate up and down these antenna. We want to again follow the yellow. Grab a hold of this. Pull ourselves up. Pretty easy. There's a nest here. There are abandoned nests all over the place. But there are eggs in it. That's impossible. What are their colors? White with dots. Brown dots? That's right. How many are there? Six? Uh, five. <laughs> Sparrow Cook! Oh, wait, and I love you. If nature is returning to the city, it means the air is getting cleaner. The amount of chemical particulates in the air is going down. Get away from the nest at once. But what about the tape recorder? No self-respecting bird watcher would disturb a nesting bird. Let's hope the young hatch. Yeah, they're probably safe here. I think so. Thank you, Aiden. This is really a great day for me. I'm glad I could help. So learning to do this initial climb methodology goes ahead and allows us to get the bird watching quest taken care of. So we'll sign off here and we'll continue this with climbing the historical antenna.